seems inconspicuous enough. It's like a small mansion. I wonder if Chris's blood is by the fireplace. No, it's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, Faith. Something bad's gonna happen. Something so bad's gonna happen. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I only found I out yesterday. Calm you. down, bitch. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Look, who we're gives trying a our shit best about here. the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? He's got a point. How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, I'm not sure. A lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games. Uh. Whoever it was, seems like they're following us. I don't like being all yeah. the more reason to get on a damn boat where we can't be followed. I'm not going they could back get on a boat too, Kenny. Omid needs to rest. Can we all just keep our voices down? Uh, let's rest I up. I think we could all use a little time to rest up and gather our thoughts, Kenny. At least until those walkers outside wander off and Omid's feeling better. He best feel better quick. I ain't gonna wait around here too long. You know, Kenny, you've been through shit, I'll give you that, but calm down, man. Calm down. Place seems secure, at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. Thank you. All right. Fine. About time someone me, pointed that upstairs. out. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door. Understand? Cool. Okay. Can I help? What if there's another locked door? I think you've been helpful enough for one day, kiddo. Why don't you just see if Kristen Omi need anything? Okay. Okay. Look, Clementine, like, I like you and all, and I'm happy you got us in the house, but you're, like, ten, so, you know, just, hey, just trying to be a good role model, which is kind of difficult in the zombie apocalypse. All empty. Damn. I was really hoping for some Chef Boy RD. You ever had the ravioli? It's fantastic. Nothing. Water's off. That doesn't surprise me. Microwave work? Damn. No power. No popcorn for us. What else? Fridge. I should probably check in doors and stuff, but I'm hungry. All cleaned out. May as well check the freezer. Ah. Sorry, I kind of had to desecrate your dog's grave and accidentally decapitate it. That was a. Uh... Now I feel even worse. Here's the thing about the Walking Dead game, and you know what? Also the comic, and I guess the TV show. You just feel like an asshole. You like it's so depressing. Every every aspect of it is so sad. I'm not that hungry. Besides, I need to finish checking the downstairs. I'd try it. Gibbles and bits. That dog goes crazy in the commercials. It must be delish. All right, the clock. Working a while ago. Well, there's no power, so not surprising. Unless, wait, no, those things are on batteries. What? You know what? Ignore me. You know what I'm talking about? Bottle of whiskey. Taking it. Probably not the best idea right now. Fuck you, Lee. Need to stay frosty. I'm in control. I said to drink. You drink. Whoever cleared this place out left behind two bottles of whiskey. Looks like someone didn't have their priorities straight. You. J How's <clears> it coming? I'm looking around. Chill. I just like you expensive. just like whiskey. That's Heavy. no doubt. Any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. So we're probably gonna have to use that to block a door at some point. Uh, hey, like no, we shouldn't the whiskey. That's I shouldn't drink. My God, keep a clear head. But <laughs> man, I really could use a drink right now. You contradictory son of a bitch. Hey guys, how's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far so good. Yeah, I searched the room immediately adjacent to you. How's that couch treating you, Omid? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. 
couches don't typically Ooh. solve blood loss. So. About this house. Finding this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. Agreed. I'll make sure. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. Oh, I Lee, you son of a bitch. Really, I would. You don't say that. You know what's going to happen? Your luck is going to get so much worse in the next five, ten minutes. What do you guys think about this plan, Achilles? The guy's losing it. Duh. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over it. Kenny's solid. He's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope you're right. For all our sakes. I was Kenny's Sit like... Tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. I was Kenny's like BFF Thanks, in the first episode, but episode two and three, I disagreed with him almost all the time. I sided with Lily a lot of it. Which is so interesting about this game. The thing I love about this series is that you will be friends with one character, and the next episode, you will not agree with what they're saying, and you will turn Open your backs up, on okay. them. I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? I get it, game. My no, objective well, is to check care. the rooms. I got it. I'm on it. I just want to talk to Clem, okay? I care about her. She's one of my favorite characters in the series, next to Carly. What's this? Oh, paintings. Disgusting. Not and inappropriate. Exactly my style. I like Light Bright. Not good job, Lee, taking out your gun like that. Huh? Huh? Nope. Nothing hiding in here. Did you check the closet? Zombies do have tendencies to hide in closet. Did you play Resident Evil 1? Itchy tasty, you know, guy just kinda jumped out. One of these doors is gonna have a zombie. And now we have to shoot it. And that's loud, and that should attract all the walkers outside, which is bad. Ha! -ha! All clear in here. Although, also, that's not the best way to check a door. I would recommend... Just one more to check. I would recommend opening the door and then backing up five steps and then pointing your gun at the door for a couple seconds. Bef don't just reach your hand and be like, Anyone in here? Huh? Hmm? Hmm? Um, can I go upstairs? Or is it going to tell me Maybe to check? Have the second floor covered. Yeah. I should finish checking down here. I kind of sense that those two are going to fight. Ben is probably going to reveal something to Kenny. I don't know. This, I don't know. These episodes are all very unpredictable for the most part. So we'll see. All right now, open and then back up. All right, we're going to open this door and shit's going to go real. Jesus! Oh, God, it's the evil broom. What? What happened? It's a broom. It's don't worry, guys. I got it. It's a broom. Nothing. I took out the broom, guys. Everything's okay. This ain't good. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. I'm gonna guarantee it did. I suppose did. you turned up any meds while you were poking around. Nah, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. Whiskey could disinfect the wound. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell her. Who is he? It's not your father. It's not your father. Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. Hmm? I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? Wait, you have the radio now, Clem? I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Oh, I don't trust him. Honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Problem? Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. I figured. K Ken Kenny, Kenny? He thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. Kenny? He's up there. You okay? I can't get him to come down. He would have screamed. Stay here. Ben? If something hurt him, he would have screamed. I'm assuming he just wanted some alone time. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Kenny? Kenny? Ken 
Can he? Jimmy. Yeah, he just needed some alone time. You want to hug it out, man? Kenny, you okay, man? Stupid question. Oh, Jesus. The hell is that? Or he oh found something God. terrible. Oh, no! Dude! I never thought they'd actually show a zombified kid. You shot Duck before that happened. Kind of looks like Duck, don't he? Yeah, like strangely he does. What the hell happened to him? What do you I think, know. Lee? Guess he must have been hiding out of here. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. You know what? I'll take care of it. I can't ask you to do this, man. I'll take care of it. Like I did before. Are you sure? I guess we'll find out. Well, I can't, like, I can't just leave him up here. That's not safe. And also, it's miserable. I just... This is so fucked up. <laughs> man, this is fucked up. Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. Oh, this could have been Clementine if I hadn't found her when I did. Though, like, kid, I do feel sorry for you. I do. But if you're feeling that hungry, go the fuck downstairs. Like, eh. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm being an asshole. This isn't appropriate. I don't want to shoot him because that's too loud. I could beat him to death with the wrench. Or I could curb stomp his ass. And I don't really like either option. I guess I'm gonna go curb stomp him. Shit. Oh, this is Lee. Lee, why do you have to slow? Don't do it slowly. Just do it, man. Oh, this is terrible. I'm sorry. So am I. Oh, man. Oh, I was like a grape. <sighs> we should bury him. I'll take care of it. This seems unsafe, but... See... I'm a cynical guy. Stuff like that. Like, I'm not, like, weeping over here, but that kind of stuff is just messed up. I just... Are we gonna walk him by Clementine, everyone? Maybe give a little warning? It's still disgusting. I know it's a kid and all, but that's still kind of... Oh, I'm going to bury him with his dog. Oh, man. Yeah, this, is a, this is such a bummer. This whole series is a bummer. All right. There you go, buddy. You and Fido, or whatever his name was. The dog does have a name. It was on the fridge, but... This game really likes to linger on stuff like that. Uh, oh, what can I do? Look at him. Yeah, that's still a dead kid. Wearing short shorts. And no shirt, actually, now that I think about it. This is just kind of messed up. Oh, I, have to, I have to actually put the dirt on. Huh. Okay, just... Lee, just come on. There... I know it's sad, but... 
you still got a crowd out, like, just on the other side of this wall that you should probably worry about. So, hurry up. It's especially because Clem is watching. Hurry up. Don't let her see that. Even though she probably already did when you walked by it unannounced. This is really sad. I kind of feel like I shouldn't talk, but... You know... Commentary. I gotta do it. It's a game. I'm playing it for YouTube. One more should do it. Video game rule of threes, right? Or not. Guess I'll keep doing it. Oh, shit! You're dead. No, you're not! Hey! That's the kid's father. I, I don't know who it is, so... Who are you? What the hell do you want from us? Lee, what's going on? There was a guy here. I saw someone standing there by the fence. Watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? It was definitely a man. Good look. It was a man. Matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. Jimmy? I'm fine. I just... I'm fine. You're not fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Neither do I, Ben. Walkers are one thing, but the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. That's a problem. We stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if we'll need well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. I'm with Kenny. The sooner we get the hell out of here, the better. Yeah, then I don't hell, like... What are we waiting for? I'll go get my I don't stuff. like everyone. No. I don't like having and people watching us. I don't down. like zombies outside. Lee and I can go scout the river while the rest of you get ready to move out. You stay behind with Krista and Omid. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Um. Stay here. Clem, honey, I, I think it'd be best if you stayed here with Ben. I need you to watch out for Omid and Krista. Help them get ready to move out. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I know, it, it's just this once. Sometimes we all have to put aside what we want for the good of the group. Hey, don't worry. I'll be back before you know it, okay? Okay. It can't... Hey, light's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. The thing is, I'm trying to look at this from a storytelling perspective. Uh, so hold on. you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Yeah, you, f you have fucked up so many times. No offense, Ben. No offense, Ben, but I'd feel safer if you stayed here. How am I supposed to not take offense to that? What am I, a liability? Yes. Absolutely. Great. Just great. Thanks a lot for the vote of confidence. You have given confidence me... Confidence earned, Ben. Exactly. And you've got a long way to go to earn yours back after some of the stuff you pulled. Absolutely. You yeah. Yeah, I feel you. Ben, you have zero right to call me out. Okay? You want to know what you've done? You joined our group. Contributed nothing in episode two. In episode three, you got her kill. You got, you got, um, oh no. You got Carly killed. I forgot her name for a second. You got Carly shot in the face. And then, and in this episode, you left Clementine to die. So, fuck you, Ben. No other real way I can put that. Fuck you.